Question 6. The diagram shows the plan of Mrs. Phillips' living room floor. She's going to cover it with floorboards. Now one pack of floorboards is going to cover 2.5 metres squared. How many packs of floorboards does she need? We must show our working out. So first of all, we need to work out the total area of this living room, which is made from two rectangles. Now you can split the rectangles vertically or horizontally. I'm going to do it vertically. Now the new length is going to be 6 take away 2, so that's going to be 4 metres by 2 metres for this blue rectangle I'm colouring in now. So 4 by 2, 4 times 2 is 8 metres squared for the blue rectangle. So now we need to work out the rectangle on the left. which I'm going to colour in in pink and that's 5 by 2 so 5 times 2 is 10 metres squared I'm just going to write that in 10 metres squared so the total area would be 10 add 8 so the total area of this living room is 18 metres squared now if we read the question it says how many packs of floorboards are we going to need or does she need and one pack covers 2.5 meters square so do 18 divided by 2.5 and that actually gives us an answer of 7.2 therefore she needs more than 7 packs as you can't get half packs, she'll have to have eight packs. Question six is a four mark question. You get one mark for attempting to work out one area, one of those areas and another mark for successfully working out the, f the compound area. You get one mark for trying to find out how many packs she's going to need and one mark for eight packs.